Hey guys, welcome back. So uh, right here I've got a square lashing and that's exactly what we're gonna do right here. This is just a uh, temporary uh, bamboo pole we're gonna lash to these two trees. So I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna start on my outside here because this is the end of the pole and I wanna keep the bulk of my, uh, not on the exterior, away from this area. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with a clove hitch. And you guys all remember the clove hitch. Uh, I've got a video on that, so go ahead and tie your clove hitch like normal. I like to give it a little extra tag and slide it in. It's going to move around a little bit, but with this extra tag, we're going to make sure it follow it. Uh, you're basically going to tie what's called a timber hitch, and I can make another video separate of that of this one, where you wrap it around the standing end here, which is now becoming the working end. And you see, I'm gonna go back behind the tree. We're gonna wrap up. So now we're over the bamboo. Come back around. Now I'm gonna, I'm on this side of my knot. Wrap back, and now make sure you're pulling tight. I want this to pull tight. back on this side pull tight see now I'm just to the side the inside or the outside of my knot for my turn pull tight wrap around I'm gonna do this three side three on each side pull tight come back around under now look at that we got three on the left side pull tight come back around so what you can do now is pull it back over and we're going to now do what's called frapping. Instead of wrapping the tree, we're now frapping the rope itself. And we're going to do that two to three times. I'm going to do three because that's how many I did on the other one. So bam, there's one. Pull your tag through. Two. There's the frap, the second frap. See, it's laying on top. Pull that around. Pull it tight. Now here comes number three. Three fraps laying on top of each other. Pull that tight. And now I'm coming across the bottom because the bottom needs, it's got two, it needs that third one too, just to match. Um, pull it tight and what I'm gonna do now is finish it off with a clove hitch again on this side so crossing itself just like that up and I'm gonna tuck under itself just like that pull the tag through We're gonna dress that up and bam, you've got your square lashing on here to match your square lashing on here. This is good and strong. I think the bamboo pole will break before um, the ropes give out, which is perfect. So yeah, this one's a little bit more intensive, uses a lot more of your, uh, your rope, but give it a shot. It's a good, um, a good one to learn. And as you see, you can get something set up like this you could throw a tarp over here, tent. You could put tools up against this. I forgot to show you what the back's gonna look like. So that's what the back's gonna look like. You got your top wraps here, your bottom wraps. Uh, ideally, you want these perfect without any overlap. I've got a little bit of overlap here. Same thing on this side. I got a little bit of overlap right here, but for my uses, it's gonna be fine. So yeah, give it a go, practice, and I'll see you for another one. 